Hello, I'm a worm. Day five. Day five. We're on our way to get Korean barbecue. We're going to um, Road to Seoul because it's $18 for all you can eat. And we're really hungry. So, yeah. 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 I'm excited. Yeah. 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 That's yeah. It. That's it. yeah. yeah. So John and I found free four hour parking and um, John and I have been paying for parking a lot and it's kind of adding up so it's like one dollar <laughs> here, four dollars there, ten dollars there. there. Yeah, so it's been adding up and I was talking to Yuyen last night and telling her how we've been paying for parking and she was like when she and her boyfriend came, they didn't pay for parking at all and they always just found free parking so I am challenging me and John for the rest of our trip to not pay for parking anymore. Also, these pants are loose right now but after Korean barbecue, they're gonna be tight as heck. Oh, watch out! <laughs> also, I've been like looking back at the videos that we've taken um, like throughout the days that we've been here and I've definitely gained weight really? since we got here. Okay, yeah, me too. like my face got a lot chubby. Oh gosh! <laughs> but it'd be like that. Yeah, worth it. birthday and he hasn't worn them yet and today is his first day wearing them out oh you like them they're so comfy we're at seven leaves cafe we're sitting um outside this little movie theater and there's all these little cute seats. John got a matcha with boba and I got the summer mint. My straw's not working. <laughs> oh, got it. Oh, you got it? So while we're sitting here, I wanted to show um, John's pop socket. It's me! And she poor. Cute. If you ever want to get a present for your boyfriend or girlfriend, get them a pop socket of yourself. Great gift. <laughs> Everyone knows I'm taken on the trade. So, do you guys remember the first day when I said, oh John, we can finally figure out if LA boba is better than New York boba and yeah. John was like why like how different could it be prove me wrong LA now he's saying LA boba is better there's no going back now I have to blot my face because I had the meat sweat <laughs> we already failed the free parking challenge I could park down there Maybe it's free. Yeah, go park down there. This is such a good spot. I just paid two dollars. <laughs> Me and John are at Rodeo Drive, and we didn't go into any of the stores because we're literally wearing Forever Twenty One. Um, we stopped by the Beverly Hills Hotel because I wanted a picture but there was already someone there taking pictures and then we were waiting for her to finish and once it was like almost our turn the security came out 
and kick this out because the the spot that everyone goes to to take the picture is where cars pull in to actually go to the hotel which I wasn't expecting just because I thought that it was a tourist attraction so I thought that it was meant for visitors but then like it was literally in the driveway so I think they just kick people out like every five minutes all right so my pants keep falling and I'm gonna try wearing Emily's belt but my theory is that I'm too fat and it won't wrap around my waist <laughs> <laughs> Does anyone else's boyfriend do this? Every single time he's looking for his car and he's pressing the little beeping button, he presses it against his chin. Your head becomes an antenna. Oh yeah, he said your head becomes an antenna. <laughs> Life hack for people if you like want to take a picture but you're with someone who just sucks at taking photos and gives you like the most tragic <laughs> angles. What I do with John is I literally have him stand where I'm gonna stand and I show him how I want the photo framed and then I just show him the photo with him as the model and then tell him to replicate it exactly. <laughs> this was at Alfred's tea room and this was the angle that John gave me before I showed him how I like wanted it to look and then I used him as a model and angled the shot for him and then he took this one for me and then at LACMA we did the same thing. And that's our process. Another blue shirt. More blue. So this is the Goodwill that we came to. It was really nice. Everything was really organized. And now we're getting tacos from La Esquina. I got a shrimp taco, a chicken taco, and a steak taco. You got an al pastor burrito? No, no. Mm. It's good? Okay. So good. See the inside? Holy <laughs> crap. <laughs> so John picked up a few things from Goodwill. And then he also got some things from Cotton On earlier. Mm -hmm. Almost everything is blue. Yep. He everything only is... wears blue. <laughs> He's literally wearing blue right now. Did you like the burrito? Yeah, the tacos were really good. John and I are back for the third time this trip. John to show his haul. <laughs> Let me just get a little close up. So we have some solid light blue, some stripe light blue, some other stripe light blue, stripe light blue with bigger stripes, a dark blue, another dark blue, some more stripe light blue. <laughs> Some more solid these light are, blue. These are the ones I brought from home. Here's John's Goodwill one. It's nice. Six dollars. Continue straight. Close is at seven. Okay, let's go. Sugar fish, lemonade, and fill. Lemonade's a restaurant? All in one spot. We got the mango chicken bowl and the blood orange lemonade. Next stop, Phil's Coffee. coffee. This is me before Boba. All the places that I wanted to visit, like the chain ones, like they're all in this mall. This one's a tent. Like this is literally how I like my coffee. Yeah, it is. It's, it's like really sweet, good. but not too sweet. What did you just say? So can we hold her hands for three years, damn it? <laughs> No you want to hold him? So, show no affection anymore. <laughs> we literally came all the way to LA for Panda Express. Uh, 
Uh, they also asked if we wanted a fresh batch of Oh yeah, that was so nice. Quinoa, some noodles, some orange chicken, and some string beans and chicken. Which further confirms that you are in the friend zone. Yeah. Opening the door for me for the camera. Chivalry's not dead. Opening the door for me just no. for the camera, huh? I was doing that whole trip. Thanks. Well, I should vlog more. I was doing that whole trip. <laughs> Do I look like Ozzy Osbourne? No. <laughs> what? What? Well, we look like two douchebags. Back in the car after five minutes. On the um, Hollywood Walk of Fame. What were your thoughts? It was okay. We're at Melrose Avenue and we found the pink wall. She's <laughs> walking. <laughs> oh, who is she? Wow, well, this could be your beatbox um, album cover. Wow, well, who is she? at three different price points to figure out which one's the most worth it at its price. Tea fact! <laughs> oh, I don't have a tea fact. Oh, well, <laughs> we got bamboozled. <laughs> 